I think the main thing that is always asked before we come out with a product is what data is driving the decision that you're making. You need good data. You need good data around what your customers are doing, you know, the seasonality of certain products, and we're very fortunate to have a tool where we can look in every day to kind of get that data and make those decisions. Data, obviously, it just provides answers. We were completely shooting in the dark before. The biggest challenge, I think, was the amount of time it took to update reports. We were working out of spreadsheets. I was looking at each individual channel, and then I was also looking at third-party reporting. It was just taking so much time to figure out how the data was working together. We didn't know where we should be going, how many things we should be ordering, or how things were performing, but now we know. The best thing about Domo is that one day I come to work and all of a sudden everything is just in one place. And it saves me so much time because I can look at the performance on Facebook and I can look at the performance on Pinterest right next to each other. We try to focus on how do we use the data from yesterday, from last week, from last month, or even last year because the business is pretty seasonal. I work in the product development department. I like to look at the sizes that are selling well. I like to look at the colors that are selling well and then also the opposite, so what's not selling well and what's not performing the best, so that way we know for future products, hey, navy is a really popular color for our customers, so maybe we should come out with more navy products. We get here in the office and the conversations just happen around the data that we pull from Delmo, and it's a, it's a critical piece of how we operate, specifically around such areas as, as inventory and marketing. As the summer heat has ramped up, we've also noticed in Domo, our numbers on sheets were just skyrocketing and the other ones were kind of trickling out. We were able to go in and optimize our campaigns so that we're promoting certain products over other ones and not simply just wasting money and we can improve that spend efficiency. We've been able to ingest data from our freight forwarder and a big metric we've been able to look at is lead time and transit time to get the product to us we've been able to use that data. Ultimately, if the product doesn't get here in time, especially if it's a new product, then you know, that means we have to push back uh, product launch, or you know, if stuff's going out of stock, then that is potential loss in revenue. Uh, honestly, the first 45 minutes of my day is, is in Domo, looking about yesterday's profitability or the percentage of product revenue that was bedding to loungewear, to sleepwear, to bath. I love that it's all my data in one place and that we can customize it to be actionable for us. You know, creating dashboards and visuals, it's very intuitive and user-friendly. It's super customizable to not only Cozy Earth, but me as an individual and worker here. You don't need a whole lot of background experience or expertise, especially on the data side, to be able to you know, ingest the data and clean the data. Domo has native connectors where it's just easy to connect to a couple minutes and you're, you're already pulling the data in. I find it fun to look at the product velocity. I think it's fun to just see how we've been selling and just to see how specific SKUs are doing. We also import survey data from our customers and so we get to see why they're buying so that we can address those value props that we have to really push customers to make that purchase. Everyone uses Domo. It is the single thing that we feel like helps us to make proper decisions day to day.